here in October. This self seeded pheasant berry which only started growing this year is already flowering. Also, here this marguerite daisy which is also self seeded from a plant that was growing here last year. Still blooming. Some evening primrose continue to flower. The leaves are starting to change on this staghorn sumac. So Pestamon continues to bloom, as does some Russimon bulls mauve. This Cape fuchsia. Producing some new flowers after they were trimmed back a few weeks ago. Some pot marigold continue to bloom. As is this variety of broom. Also flowering after some of the older stems were trimmed back is this uh, geum. The original pheasantberry shrub that I planted has some flowers and berries. This Bodleia continues to have some flowers. Tynus has just started to flower. Well, this newly created flower bed has only just been planted. Ranja continues to flower well. Some rocket continues to have some flowers. We also hear this liquid amber is just starting to a change in its colour to its leaves. This uh, Catoni Aster has a nice colour to its berries. This smoke bush continues to have good colour to its leaves, contrasting with the lighter coloured leaves of this uh, Russian olive. So blooming here is this ajuga with the red blooms of a newly planted diacea. Another self seeded pheasant berry is flowering. And this Basilment is now in full bloom. This verbena continues to bloom well. Plant itself, yeah, also blooming. Well, this uh, 
Hakib. As I said, it's a good time to floor. Montbrisia still have some flowers. Let's do some of the red valerian. Uh, Abelia also continues to bloom on. Well. 